Is he in there? Who? Don't be coy. Luke, where is he? Uh, last I heard, he was on the open road. <laughs> yeah, but you're obviously waiting for somebody. Uh, more like hoping. Oh, wow, the clarity is amazing. It's nearly flawless. I know. Did Luke give that to you? Who else would play mind games like that? Well, what does he want? He wants me to meet him at the Metro Court. I was hoping to avoid a scene. Oh, but you're both so good at making them. I am through being his patsy. But I thought you loved his games. Don't go there. Your sister already tried. Luke divorced me. It's over. Well, then I guess you should go to the Metro Court and tell him that. Fine. Keep protecting him. I hope he shows up. And if he doesn't, I guess he'll be sending a clear message that he doesn't care. Just like the person you're waiting for. So, did your no-good uncle make a dinner reservation? Happy New Year to you too, Tracy. No, I haven't heard from Luke, but there is a table in the corner reserved under your name. <laughs> Hello, gorgeous. I knew you'd accept my invitation. Your invitation? You were expecting someone else? Well, the diamond arrived What can I my... say? I'm an incurable romantic. <laughs> no. Forget it. What the hell are you doing here? Let it go. Give a lady a diamond you expect, at the very least, that she's not going to run away from you. How many times do I have to say no before it sticks? Well, it's not a matter of repetition. I just don't believe you mean it. When this elevator reaches the lobby, I'm going to get in my car and I'm going to drive home, and I do not want you to follow me. What was that? Fate. How did you do that? How did you make it stop? I'm just standing here admiring the scenery. Help! Help! Somebody! We're trapped in the elevator! Loud party going on upstairs, Tracy. I'm thinking I'm the only one who's gonna hear you screaming. Could you get away from me, please? Could you move back into that corner? Whatever Go. Whatever you want, doll. Obviously, eventually, they're gonna realize that we're stuck in the elevator. Well, that's okay. By then, I'll have gotten exactly what I came for. If you think for one second that I would degrade myself in a hotel elevator with you. Is that how little you think of me? Maybe less. Forgive me. I know I've been aggressive in pursuing you, but it's only because I hold you in such high regard. Oh, of course, and that's why you're blackmailing me with Gino Salito. Well, there's all kinds of ways to woo a beautiful woman. I think you'd appreciate the effort, given your own history. You don't know me. I know more than you think. And as much as I would love to share a night of passion and intimacy with you, I was wrong to go after it the way I did. I have told you all along that you are wasting your time. But you haven't mentioned if you like the diamond. Oh, of course. I'm sorry. We've moved on to bribery. Are you so damaged by the men in your life that you can't accept a gift when it's freely given? You do not know me. You deserve better, Tracy. Remember my note said I have the setting? You can't be that deluded. Tracy Quarterman, you set my world on fire. Will you marry me? <laughs> <laughs>